Hello, today we're going to talk about how Jesus belonged to the Holy Family. So the Holy Family is of Mary, Joseph, and Jesus. And remember, God specifically chose Mary and Joseph to be um, the mother and foster father of Jesus because they were such good people. Um, so in the last chapter, we learned about Jesus' birth and about how Mary and Joseph cared for their newborn child. And the story comes from the Bible. The Bible also tells us that Mary and Joseph raised Jesus with love and cared for him as he grew up. Mary and Joseph wanted to raise Jesus in their faith. As a family, they wanted to follow God's law. So Mary and Joseph took Jesus to the temple to be blessed. The Bible says that Jesus, after Jesus was blessed, Mary and Joseph took Jesus back to Nazareth, where Jesus grew and became strong, and he learned how to be wise and see the favor of God was upon him. When Jesus was old enough, Mary and Joseph took him to the temple again for a special festival. The Bible tells us that when they returned to Nazareth, Jesus was obedient to his parents and he continued to grow in wisdom. People were impressed with Jesus and God's favor was with him. So Jesus probably helped Joseph make a table or a chair just like we help our mom or dad, mom, dad, brother, sister, grandma, grandpa, anyone to do something else. Um, so maybe Mary taught Jesus the words to song just as a family member might help you learn a prayer. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph had good times together, talking, laughing, and playing. They also prayed together and they prayed every day and they prayed the prayers from the scripture. And every year, Mary and Joseph made a long special journey to the temple to pray. When Jesus was old enough, he went to. Um... So other things that they might have done besides just going to the temple as a family was eat meals and clean the house together and visiting relatives and praying together. Um, so there are some different things that each family likes to do um, and different ways that families like to do things. So the holy family of Mary, Joseph, and Jesus, they like to go to the temple, they like to pray, they like to create things because Joseph was a carpenter, which means he made stuff like the chairs or a table that were mentioned earlier. Um, <clears throat> so this was just kind of like a typical family. Uh, just because Jesus was the son of God doesn't mean that their family was much different from ours. Uh, like it, they kind of are because they do things differently than we would. Um, or maybe they do some of the things that are the same, like praying with our family or eating meals together or something like that if you do that with your family. So we have some similarities with the Holy Family, but we also have some differences with the Holy Family because I can tell you I've never made a table or a chair with someone in my family like Jesus probably did. So most of the houses in Nazareth had flat roofs that could be reached by outdoor stairways. On hot nights, the family would sleep on the roof. So each person in the Holy Family was special. Jesus was special because he was the child and he knew that when he obeyed his parents, they were happy and so was his father in heaven. And Jesus made his holy family happy when he got water at the well and helped his family in the carpenter shop. Um, so it's very good to be helpful when you are the child to your parents, be helpful to your parents, listening to your parents and all of that. So Mary was special in the holy family because she was the mother. She brought happiness by loving and caring for Jesus and Joseph. And they probably showed Mary love by working hard, cooking, and making clothes with her. So Mary took good care of Jesus and taught him many things. Mary made the Holy Family because she was close to God. Um, she always says yes to God. So Joseph was special in the Holy Family. He made his family happy by loving and caring for Jesus and Mary. And Joseph worked hard and he had a carpentry busy business to help the family out. So Joseph made the family holy because he loved God very much and he always did what God wanted. So all the members of the family do different things and special things to be special in the holy family. They all have a different role in the family as a mother, as a foster father, as a child. Um, so God wants families to live together in love and God wants family members to care about one another. But sometimes not all families are at peace. Sometimes family members do not live together in love. 
So sometimes family members can be unhappy and we need to try and make happy again in the family by helping each other and showing each other that we love each other and spending time together. So like for Mary, Jesus and Joseph, it's helping with the carpenter business, making clothes, feeding the family, praying together, going to the temple, things like that. So each family has different things that make um, each other happy uh, that you should do. So like for my family, a way to make my family happy is to be spending time together. So it's really hard to get all of us together because there's so many of us and we are all doing different things and live in different areas. So when we're all together, it makes our family really happy and really good. Um, so it's always important to keep your family happy. And since as a child, usually, um, it's really important that you help your family out, uh, your grownups out whenever you can uh, to make your family stay happy. And that's all for religion today.